Hi. In this session, we will learn the next topic in the function model in RFC is the update function model. An update function model is the function model for which in the function builder, the property update model is marked as a processing type. So where is this setting? When we log into SC37, so on the attributes tab, by default, the radio button regular FM is selected. Next is remote enable and after that, here we can see update module. So in case if any function module you want to make as update FM, we have to select this radio button. Let's understand how exactly the update FM is different from the normal function model. The main update technique for the bundling of database changes in a single logical unit is to use call update FM in update task. This means that whenever you want to call the update function model in the program, we have to add this in update task. Otherwise, the function model will work as a normal FM. Now let's see the difference, how it is different from the normal FM. So during the program execution, when system reaches the statement, that is call function and the function model name in update task. So here, instead of executing all the insert, update, delete functions, instead of executing all this immediately, in case of update task, system schedule for execution in a special work process that is called as the update work process. Okay, if you are not using in update task, if you are calling any FM in normal mode, it works in a dialog work process and all the data gets updated as soon as those lines get executed. But in case of update task, even though with the function model is called, the data will not be inserted, updated or deleted, rather it will be scheduled for execution. Okay, and it is stored in the database tables like VBMod, VBHDR, VBData. We can check the details in those data. Now here, when this will get updated into database table? So after calling the function model, in the program, we can have single function model in update task or multiple. So after calling all the function model, when system reaches the statement commit for, at that time, system check all the register function model, which are in update task, and after the commit work, all gets updated. The logic behind the update function model is very simple. It is like either commit all the changes at once or roll back all the changes. So let's understand this in more detail with this program. Take example in the program, we are inserting the header record from a header table. So in program, as soon as we press F5, so from this internal table, the header record will be inserted into the database table. And same for the item table and so on. But imagine a scenario, our header record is inserted, but the item record is failed for any reason. So in that case, what will happen? There will be an inconsistency in the database because the header record is updated. Okay, but for any reason, for some validation or for some data issue, the item table is failed. So in that case, there is no meaning of header record. So to avoid all this, we have to use update function concept. In that case, what will happen? Either all like header, item, schedule, and update, deleted, either all will be updated properly or if any one fail, then all will get fail.
Okay. So for this, what we can do? We have to create the function model that is update fm. And in case instead of program, even if you are writing the same code in normal function model, here also the concept will be same. As soon as this statement is executed, data will get updated. And here, if it is fail, but first one is already inserted. That's why instead of normal function model, we have to use this update FM. So here, what will happen? As soon as system executes a statement, it is scheduled for execution instead of executing immediately. Same for others. And after the FM, whether we have single FM or multiple FM, when system reaches its commit to work statement, then system checks all the register object in the schedule table and system perform the respective insert, update and delete operation. Fine. So this is the theoretical part about the update function model. Next, we'll create a function model which will work as a update FM.